What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for stopping by. As always, hope you're having a great day. Today we're gonna to be doing a gear review. Today we're gonna to be talking about Guardian Angel devices, talking about the new Elite series that they just released. We have the old one right here. And we're gonna talk about the new features on this one, the things that they changed on it, and if the upgrade to this one would be worth your while. So just like the old ones, they have an infrared and they have a non-infrared series. We have both of them right here. The infrared series has this button right here and it just makes that light strobe. This one is the one, it's about $30 cheaper and it has no infrared and that light is just an LED light and it just shines up. And if you press it again, it does go into an SOS. So both of them are very beneficial, no matter which one, but the IR one, the infrared one does cost about $25 or $30 more. I do have the red and blue series on both of these, so there's no difference except for the infrared and the SOS. Everything else works exactly the same. So if you can't spend that extra money to get the infrared one and you really don't need it, the other one would work just fine. One thing the older one had was I carry mine, I keep it mounted on my shoulder right here, reach up, you would press the button and it would shine a flashlight, press it one more time and it shines a red light. And if you work at nighttime, that kills your natural night vision before you get to the red light, which doesn't kill your natural night vision. So it was a little bit counterproductive, but they fixed that in the new series. You press the front button right here and it turns the red on and you do not cycle to white at all, but you can press and hold it and it will turn white on. It does have red and blues on in the back and the light on in the front. Press it again, it goes back to red, press it again, and it turns off. And you're not going to go through the white unless you press and you hold it. So that's, that's for me, that's a big key thing that automatically makes it worth the upgrade from the old one to the new one. If you work in the dark, if you work at nighttime. On the older one, you also had the charging port was on the bottom. And so you couldn't keep it on any mounts because you had to open that up and plug it in through right there. You couldn't keep it on a mount. The mount that comes with it is this one. You couldn't keep it on there. You couldn't put it on any other mounts while you were charging it because these mounts, they are magnet mounts, but you can also screw them to the device with the four screws on the bottom. So if you have it permanently mounted to something, it can be a pain in the butt to have to take the whole mount off with the Allen head screws just to charge it. And so they changed it on the new one and the charging port is actually on the side. It still takes the USB-C. It does come with a USB-C cable. It is a short one. So if you need a long one, you're gonna have to get that one yourself. But with it being on the side right there is very beneficial because you can keep it on any mount. You can keep it mounted to anything and you don't really have to take it off. One thing that really impressed me about the charging ports on the old one was it had a rubber ring on it. I actually turned it on just like this, red and blues all the way around. I put it in water and I froze it and I went back and we froze it for 13 and a half hours. If you go to my Instagram, there's actually a video of it. And then it was still working. It worked through the whole 13 and a half hours underwater, completely frozen, sitting in a freezer. And speaking of 13 and a half hours, I, it takes less than two hours to charge this thing. And whenever I got my first one, I turned it on just like this, red and blues with it brightness all the way up. I left it on the countertop inside of a box and it ran for 57 and a half hours. Show me another battery that does that. I mean, that's a long time, especially if you get lost out there, if you're hiking or if you get in a wreck or something and you need that light for a long period of time, that's outstanding. They'll last that long and you don't have to worry about anything. And they have every mount possible. I have a bunch of them right here. And I mean, they have them where you can put them on handlebars. They have handlebar ones. They have windshield ones. They have wrist strap ones. They have hat clip ones. They have a backpack clip ones. They have this tether that is a quick release tether that you can tie to it. Honestly, they have every mount possible. And like I said, every mount you can take the screws off and you can screw the device straight to this if you're worried about the magnet not being strong enough. But that magnet is very strong. These are the red and blue series and they do have solid blue series for, I know some states in law enforcement only have blue lights. They have blue lights, they have construction yellow, they have orange, they have green. You can use it for hiking, you can use it for pretty much anything outdoor. I keep it on my EDC bag whenever I go out and about, just in case you never know if you're gonna possibly need it. And every mount is good because I go fishing, I can put it on my kayak, I can put it on a bike. If I'm going out riding a bike, I can put it on my backpack. If I'm going out with the family hiking, 
really it's very versatile so that's an introduction to the elite series of the guardian angel devices we are going to be torture testing devices just like we did on the old ones so make sure you stick around for that one and also they wanted to hook up my followers so the first link in the description is going to save you some money on your purchase of a device and you're going to get a free mount the mount of your choosing which is pretty good because they're regularly uh, i think the cheapest one seven dollars and it goes up to thirty dollars so that's a steal right there just for the free mount. That's going to be it for the video, guys. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks to Guardian Angel Devices for sending this product for me to show to my followers. I greatly appreciate it. If you're thinking about getting one, you'll be glad that you did if you do. First link in the description, save you some money and get you a free mount. Want to help support the channel in any other way, there are affiliate links down in the description. As always, guys, I hope you have a great rest of your day. I'll catch y'all in the next one.